do you know who the fuck I am? Do you care who I am? You don't, and I don't expect you to. What I have to say is very serious. And the only way I can say this is in a manner towards everybody can understand it. There is no man on the planet. There is not one person supreme over the other. Woman, child, whatever. We are exactly the same. Through the course of mind manipulation, you are led to believe. And if all you believe is all you see, then you need to ask the fucking question, why are things the way they are? I gotta respond on black men are not the ideal man for the Western world. We were ideal when we were picking in the fields. We were ideal while we're running the football up and down the, the field. We're ideal when we got that dunk over three or four people from Lithuania or something. We're ideal when we knock the other black guy out in the ring. I am so hurt right now. I am devastated. I have to see black people run amok in the country that captured us, slaved us, pimped us, beat us, exploited us. Their pop culture is based on us. But we can't even get along for 15 minutes. I once said, you can get 15 white millionaires. And in about four or five years, you'd have 15 white billionaires. You could take 15 black millionaires, and in the same five years, you have one black billionaire. Why is that? Why? We can't get along because we have been trained, taught, and bred not to get along. We can't respect each other beyond what we want from each other. I don't want to have to sit here and bash my people. Because you sit and you bash yourselves every day. Of course, no one wants to respect a group of fucking savages. But nobody can show respect for each other. I sit here and argue with Willie P so he can show respect to the black women and all I get is a handful of black women talking about how low and dirty black men are. Don't play the same fucking game Willie P is playing because I don't want to have to fight you two. I leave. I go for a couple days. I check a little message here and there. But you get back on this YouTube. You get back on YouTube. And in five days, three, four days, it ain't worth coming back to. It's discouraging. A group of people intelligent enough to to embrace this YouTube thing got nothing better to fucking do but bash each other I'm getting called nigger 
black son of a bitch. Stop whining about shit. When you see something dying in your hand and you can't do nothing to save it and what's dying in your hand is your future itself how the fuck you think I feel you know my son gotta grow up in this shit so he can't trust his own people because of I don't like this nigga you have become the very same thing that these people before us fought not not fought for us not to be called nigga. They fought for us to have some kind of respect. I can't do this shit no more. I can't sit back and watch everything, everything turn black and die in my hand. Pitiful. So what this black girl is stupid? So what this man is ignorant? It's our job to educate ourselves. Fuck the goddamn white people. Fuck them all. They it's not up to them to make sure we got a better life anywhere. It's not, it's not some white man's fault. Yes, yes. They have had a hand in it. They have exploited us to the point to where we won't even communicate with each other without calling each other a nigger. Not nigger. There's no excuse for nigger. Nigger. This shit was cool for about four years. It's 2008. 2000 and H A T fucking E. Can you wake up now? Because tomorrow won't be here. Tomorrow there's going to be white slaves, black slaves, and Mexican slaves. And who's going to be in charge? Who's going to run the plantations? They don't need as many people as they used to have. They got robots and technology. They don't need that many slaves no more to push fucking buttons. So what they going to do with the ones they don't need? And that's everybody who can't say nothing positive. That's everybody who can't go out and get nothing. Am I hungry? You goddamn fucking right. Am I needy? You motherfucking right. And what the fuck do I need? I need to see people walking around with self-respect. This ain't motherfucking good times. We ain't the Jeffersons moving on up to a deluxe apartment. You know what they did? They built fucking high-rise projects so you can believe you're moving fucking up to the east side. East side of what? How in the far have we moved up? And if we moved up, then how far is up? How high do you have to go before you're up? Motherfuckers is fucking killing me. Scared to death to walk down the street when you see two or three black guys. You goddamn right. Because these motherfuckers are fucking savages. Good man can't win no more. Negativity is king. And you say to yourself, how can we fix this? And every one of my white friends will tell you, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Can't do this shit. But I'm gonna finish out today, cause I promised somebody I would try to set you motherfuckers straight before I left. Now, people have to go on their little journeys before they can come back. Until I get back, you've been tubed. <laughs>